record it. So let me record it. So we proved problem 3.6 that there is no uh, critical points uh, that we can, for any function f on uh, Morse function f on a closed connected manifold, we can make this function, improve this function in such a way that it has precisely one index zero critical point. So we first we rearrange critical points. So we rearrange in such a using rearrangement theorem in such a way that index zero critical points are in here below. The index one critical points are between this part and above there are index two and more. So we want to find the canceling pair of critical points. So we start with this, take an index zero critical point. And well, there are two options. Either or the hand all cre index one critical points have are attached that are attached to this circle before it flows up are attached like there are the stable or could put say, say say one more thing the stable manifold to an index one critical point is s zero cross d n minus one so the this is the intersection of the stable manifold of index one critical point with f inverse of c this is s zero cross index d one so it's has two connected components so either this either we have a candle that such that these two connected components fit the same connected component of z of of the of this circle but then we cannot cancel we cannot cancel because there are if there are if there are like two if picture is like this or like in here then there are like two trajectories from index zero critical point to index one critical point one goes along this part or along one copy of s0 or and the other goes along the other copy of s0 but then well the number if i have a handle uh, an index one critical point like this a handle attachment like this then it doesn't change the number of connected components because it doesn't make two disconnected things connected but if I have a, if I want to make this connected to that guy, I must have a critical point of index one such that one S0 belongs to one component and the other S0 belongs to another component. So I have a critical point of index one. I can take, take any of them because there can be, can be many of them. There can be like two, three, four, five, 27 index one critical points, but I choose one critical point that the stable manifold, this S0, sits on one component here and one component here. And this S0 that is in here belongs to the unstable manifold of index zero critical point because the unstable manifold of the index zero critical point is everything, is this. So I have precisely one trajectory. And of course, there is this assumption to the cancellation theorem that there are no critical points in between. But there might be actually critical points in between. I can have like a handle somewhere lower, but I can rearrange without changing. I can rearrange and the rearrangement doesn't change the vector field. So in particular, after rearrangement, the trajectories of the vector field that were, if I had two critical points with a single trajectory connecting them, after rearrangement, I will have also still have the same trajectory, will still be a trajectory connecting the two critical points, maybe with change critical values. But I can rearrange in such a way that index zero critical points is the highest and index one critical point is the smallest. And after this rearrangement, I am in position to apply the cancellation theorem. So I apply, I remove the handle, I remove this and that. So after this rearrangement theorem, weird things, things can happen. So if I had like two, if I had like two, index one critical points attached to index zero critical points like in the picture like here, then after rearrangement, after the cancellation, I will have a picture that this other index one critical points connects now the two, um, uh, two uh, um, now the same so the, the two s zeros are on the same on the same stable manifold 
on the same as stable manifold. But th th this doesn't matter because I proceed with it by induction. But now I can say I have one less index zero critical point and then I can find uh, an index one critical point that connects it. So where does the induction stop? Well, the induction stops at the moment where I can find no index one critical point whose stable manifold belongs to the two different connected components. And then I can't, can't cancel anymore. Well, no matter what I do, I can't cancel. But if I can't cancel, then, uh, well, then the number of, this means that the number of connected components on this side is the same as the number of connected components of the level set over here, because no index one critical point changes the number of connected components of the manifold. But then my original manifold was connected. So, but, and if it's disconnected in here, then it, it's disconnected forever. That's what we already said. So I must have, if I, if my manifold is connected, the only possibility that I can't cancel anymore is that I have canceled everything, but one critical, one remaining critical point. All right, so that's